Good evening. It's been several months since the Bakersfield City School District sent a letter to parents informing them that they'll be not implementing that summer school this summer. That letter causing the Dolores Huerta Foundation to hold a press conference tonight during BCSD's board meeting in protest of that decision. 23 ABC's Josh Sanders joins us live in East Bakersfield with why the Dolores Huerta Foundation says they're concerned with the school board's decision. Josh. <laughs> Yeah, Tim, Jess, we're right now in the middle of that large gathering. And let me tell you, there are a lot of angry parents, a lot of angry people from the community here. Uh, we were just told that the uh, the board actually shut this group out. They're not letting them into that school board meeting right now. Um, they're saying that uh, the decision, the Dolores Huerta Foundation saying that BCSD's decision to eliminate summer school is going to negatively impact thousands of students across the city. The school board sent a letter to parents last December explaining that they will not have summer school as a part of the 2019 year, citing an anticipated budget reduction for the 2019-2020 year. But according to the school district, the 13-day summer program cost around $1.7 million. However, since 2016, they've seen a decrease in the number of students attending summer school, dropping from 4,400 in 2016 to just below 3,000 last summer. I spoke with Assistant Superintendent of Business Services is Steve McCain, who says the city understands the foundation's concerns and they're looking for ways to improve summer programming. Obviously, what we've seen over the last couple years is a decline. We're not reaching the students we want to reach, so we're taking time this year to to plan for the future as to how we can make the program more efficient. When you're spending that those kinds of dollars, you really want to make sure that it's paying off in the long run. Now, the Dolores Huerta Foundation says BCSD is lacking in transparency and accountability. I spoke with them earlier today. This is what they have to say about tonight's events. BCSD had already allocated the $1.6 million in their approved budget back in 2018. And so they just decided to eliminate this program without really taking any input from parents. And we don't really know where that funding is going to go towards, even though it was already on the budget plan. Now, according to BCSD, that $1.7 million goes towards 70 to 80 different educational programs throughout the summer. Tonight, the board is actually not planning on addressing the summer school issue, despite the large crowd that you see right here behind me. They say they are concerned about those 3,000 students uh, that will take part in summer school program, and that's why, again, they are reevaluating what that program looks like going uh, into the future. Uh, of course, we're going to continue to monitor the situation tonight and the latest. We'll bring you that on our website at turn 23com and our social media platforms. But for now, in East Bakersfield, Josh Sanders, 23, ABC News.